What's up everyone, welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to fix if your windows updates is completely pending or it is stuck over here like this. If you're having any pending updates like this and how we can completely fix this up if you're having this particular trouble. So let me directly get into step one by one. So the first one, we just need to go over here, search for the services and you have to click on this one. And right now, once the service is completely popping up, you just need to keep scrolling down over here and navigate to Windows Update. So keep scrolling down and find Windows Update. So right now, once you find the Windows Update over here, you can find the Windows Update, right click over here and go to the properties and make sure if the startup type has been set into manual, we have to change this one to the automatic and go for apply and go over here and make sure if it is start, if it is stopped, we have to start it and once afterwards, go for OK. And right now right click on it once again and go to the properties and this time we have to go over here right click on this one go for the restart once the restart is successfully and completely done just go over here and cross check whether if it's stop it or not if it's not stop it just close this over here and we have to close this once afterwards we just need to go over here still if you're having the trouble to search for troubleshoot settings over here and right now from here we have to click on other troubleshoots and you have to scroll down and navigate to windows update and go for drive and right now, once you go for the run, as you can see, we'll be having few options like this, what we have to select and what will be not to select. So right now from here, what we need to do is you just need to keep scrolling down or wait for a few things like they're going to ask you some questions like this, whether what, what is it actually issue? So you might be finding some issues like I can't download, install or uninstall an update or I install an update, but that update has caused the problem. So from here, I'm having the issue with I can't download, install or uninstall an update. So just go for this one. And right now they're going to give you more instructions and how to do this and you can try this out and these are the steps on how we can fix this and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification that's it bye bye